Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Welcome back to my new computer. So as you're watching this, I am going to be playing The Sims on my new computer. So this is the first time I'm ever doing this. I'm a little bit nervous because I want to see if it's actually going to work. So there might be something wrong with this video, but this is why I'm doing it so I can figure out from my mistakes. <laughs> I am going to be experiencing The Sims for the first time on a proper good quality computer that can actually run the game. So I've been playing on a laptop for the last I don't know how many years it's just been horrible I always had to run the game in laptop mode all of the graphics had to be turned down really low and the game as it is just ran like really badly so today for the first time I'm going to experience how the game is actually meant to be played right so let's boot up the game and see what it looks like instantly it just loads in this was like one of the first things that I've noticed is that the game just loads whereas mine didn't on my laptop I don't even know what we're going to be doing in the sims today but we are just just going to be seeing how it runs oh my god we're here okay that loaded extremely fast uh, this is so weird okay I think I have I have all of the packs installed the ones that I have anyways I have all the kits installed let's just start a new game let's just get a sim and let's just go into the world and experience oh my god it's already loaded in okay so I'm just gonna say no thanks <gasps> like look how beautiful it looks I'm going to do a proper video comparing my laptop to my computer if anyone's interested but I just really wanted to experience like look at his earring you can actually see the detail in his earring can you even understand this all of these sims youtubers that i watch like e have all been experiencing this the normal way but me i have been just struggling okay so this is just new to me what is this i know what the gallery is okay thank you let's just get a sim that i have actually no let's get her i don't even know if i have the custom content anymore i don't actually yeah i don't have any of the custom content except for the slippers and the socks for all of you privileged sim players that have been experiencing all these beautiful graphics I'm just so jealous, but I'm so happy that I can finally like play the game properly And the funny thing about all of this is that my computer is not trying to fly away Like the computer is like silent as if it's not struggling whatsoever This is just absolutely amazing. Like I have never been so happy my favorite game in the whole of the entire world I can actually finally play it like 10 years later. Okay I'm going to put on probably the most alpha CC possible that I have in the game because I don't have all of my CC in my game just yet and and then we're going to see how it runs in the actual world. Okay. Can I just point out that I downloaded so many eyebrows? I have never had this many eyebrows in my game. Like, this is just insane. Why does she look so angry? She's kind of giving me creepy vibe. Like, I don't think you understand how happy it makes me just to be able to, like, click a button. Just say, in between her face and scrolling out her body, I can actually scroll. Like, this is just insane. I used to never be able to do that. I don't know what shoes to put with this dress. White converse, can't go wrong. Oh my god, I absolutely love her. Look how cute she is. What accessory was the coat in? Every oh my god, why does he keep doing that? I know you look so beautiful and I can see every detail, but stop zooming in. I think we might go for the blue coat. I think that's lovely. Right, so we have Esther Rudd here. Um, Yeah, I'm kind of happy with everything. We are going to bring Esther into the world and see what it's like. I'm so excited. Okay, so just to show you how amazing this runs, we're just going to go in and see how fast it loads. Oh my god it's already in let's go to henford on bagley yeah i think henford on bagley i think that might be a nice place to start okay so just for you know to show you how amazing it runs this is the whole of the loading screen excuse me okay i'm a bit shocked <gasps> there's a fox right so this is Oh my god. Okay, seriously, look at the amount of detail that I can finally see in my game. <gasps> wow. My god. Okay, so the first thing I notice straight away, oh, that evil eye, is that my custom hair works. This kind of like single stranded alpha CC hair never worked for me on my laptop. When you ran it on laptop mode, it was like blocks. I'm going to try and show it to you in a different video, but this is the first thing I'm noticing that the eyelashes, okay, all of the detail on the face and every single strand of hair is showing up without my computer like literally screaming for help. The fact that I can do this and and the game didn't shut down. It didn't shut down. Okay, so I'm just going to press play and just going to... <gasps> 
the fox has gone into the wild. Everything is happening and I can see everything so clearly. So if you'd like to know what computer I'm actually using, I have a video about it already up on my YouTube. I'm gonna leave it linked down for you below. It has all of the specs, everything. Everything is mentioned really clearly. Like I don't really know much about computers and what they require to run Sims. So everything is linked in that video if you are interested and if you're thinking about buying a computer to run the sims this kind of computer what i have would run the sims very well for you so this is just absolutely amazing right i think we should travel <laughs> because we can let's travel to like a lot that has loads of people in it because that was another thing that was so bad on my laptop if you were on a lot that had more than like five sims the laptop would literally start sweating so everything would start lagging things would glitch actually sims would start disappearing because the the game actually just couldn't run so i'm interested to see once a few people start showing up because obviously that's how it works in the sims world like i know that the sims you know half the time they still don't have the best quality but for the first time i actually have good quality like i can zoom in and out you're probably like what is this weirdo talking about like this should be normal but it wasn't it wasn't normal for me it really really wasn't okay so i'm just happy the first time ever what's her favorite drink a root beer float we have three four five sims on one lot let's put the walls up let's literally go full max detail here do you know this might sound really stupid and kind of weird the more detail i can see on my sims face the more i can actually like connect with her and like want to play with her sometimes for me when i played the game and it was literally like block potatoes walking around the screen i could never really have like a full-on connection with my sim and i couldn't really play for a long amount of time because it would just get really sad so now i feel like because i can actually see the full-on expression on her face and i can see the detail that i put on her i can characterize the sims more give them a little bit more of a personality and in the end play for longer i couldn't really actually i could never go to san my shuno let's just do one more test before i totally start crying and let's see actually this this the stargazer lounge could never work for me let's bring all of her friends Right, the squad has arrived in a weird T-shaped formation. Okay, so, oh my God, it's running so smoothly. I don't think you understand. I could never see those buildings in the back. Like this was never something, oh my God, why am I tearing up? Why am I getting so emotional? I could never see those detail in the back of the world. Let's move on before I start crying. Why are you going to the toilet? Use? What? Okay, let's all of us swim together and see. Like there were certain actions that I couldn't do in The Sims that would just like glitch out. Do you know those like festivals in, in like San Myshuno? Could never really go to them, the game would freeze. It's just I guess the more Sims on the lot doing different activities, that used to be a struggle for my Sims, but now I can literally just experience the whole thing in the best way possible. I'm definitely gonna get a lot more technical about this in my next video where we try comparing my laptop top to my computer but as far as my first impression goes like i can see the cars i never knew that there was cars moving in the back there's buildings there is a pitch look there's a pitch down there people can play football just so like beautiful to actually be able to experience all this hard work that the sims obviously have put into the game you have to understand that there is a lot of people out there that play on you know laptops in laptop mode like the game should be experienced properly i really really highly recommend if you do like playing sims if sims is something that makes you really really truly happy and it brightens your day start saving right now <laughs> this really does sound like an ad and trust me it isn't the company that i bought my computer from was actually horrible and i hated the experience of getting the computer to me but if you can like i would a hundred percent advise you to experience this at least once in your life you can even see the reflection in the water i could never see this before this was never something i could experience this is just amazing sometimes even like layers so if you have oh my god they are literally layered together the more layers so the more walls and stuff the more like objects placed in front of sims obviously the object count in a lot that used to make the game run really badly so i used to be obsessed with making tiny little homes for my sims i used to never want to play for a long period of time because over generations of playing one family and having like items in the house it would start slowing down and the computer would just hate running it but i never played for a long time so i'm excited now to be able to do like the what is it that 10 generation challenge and just doing all these lovely challenges that i'm just so excited about well okay guys i think this is everything for today's emotional just crazy video there is definitely going to be so much more content 
coming now that I actually can create it. So make sure that you subscribe so that you don't miss out my future videos with all these ideas and like creative things that I have in my head. I can actually make them now. So this is going to be so exciting. I don't know. I'm just actually so excited that my brain is like fuzzled a little bit and I'm actually isolating at the moment as well. So it's a lot of fun really. It's all a lot of stress. So to be able to play the game and de-stress myself properly now, I'm just so happy. It actually makes me want to shed a little tear. So yeah. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed and I'll definitely, definitely see you in the next one. Bye.